an event calling tech enthusiasts and future thinkers. The ninth edition of the World Robot Conference is being held in Beijing this week, with over 400 professionals from home and abroad discussing the latest trends in the robotics industry. Now it seems that uh, because we have this opportunity to use AI also in the design process, because we have the much better energy sources like lithium, iron, batteries, etc. We also have a lot of developments in consumer electronics, cameras, etc. Right? We can now put this all together and design maybe the most complex machine we've ever built, i.e. somehow a little bit like a copy of the, the human body plus the human brain. My interests are in uh, vascular robots, uh, robots that can treat stroke, which is uh, the second leading cause of death in the world. And it's a disease that needs to be treated very, very rapidly. And so we think robotics can have a big impact in increasing the speed with which a, a, uh, a patient can be treated when they suffer from a stroke. The participants say they are impressed by the developments in China's robotics. <laughs> As of July 2024, China holds more than 190,000 effective robot-related patents, accounting for about two-thirds of the world's total. China has been the world's largest industrial robot market for 11 consecutive years. While affirming China's advantage in the robotics industry, Xin Guobing also pointed out that there's room for advancement in design capacity, industrial foundation and industrial chain innovation in the field the areas where China needs to strengthen international cooperation. The event not only focuses on promoting the development of robotics industry in Beijing and its surrounding areas, but also it goes far beyond. This conference aims at uh, more application scenarios, more comprehensive layout, and more integrated global cooperation in the industry of robotics. Liu Jiaxin, CGTN, Beijing.